the most polarizing figures are the people in the establishment. It's people in the leadership team. They rely on polarization because they're not principled. When you're not principled, how do you distinguish yourself from the other side? You throw jabs at them, you blame everything on them, because you can't distinguish yourself on the actual principles. It's not about cutting spending or protecting rights or fighting corporate welfare. It becomes that the Democrats are evil and we need to stop them at all costs. And if only we had more Republicans, everything would be good. But that's not the truth. That's not the reality. But that's what they try to sell to the American people. And unfortunately, uh, many of my colleagues who are uh, most within the establishment dynamic, most within uh, connected, most connected to leadership, are the most partisan. And there are those of us um, who are conservative, who are more principled, who follow the Constitution, who work much better with Democrats. You won't hear me uh, calling Democrats names and going out and um, attacking them the way that our leadership team does. I try to work with Democrats and try to build coalitions. We're not going to agree on everything. I understand that.